Hey everyone, it's Nicole. And Jamie. We hope that you are doing well. It is Thursday evening when we are filming this. Um, we have a new product that Jamie created that we wanted to do a tutorial on or do a behind the scenes, as you like to refer to it, right? Behind the magic. <laughs> behind the magic. Oh, that's right. Um, to show you, oh, there's oh, Orion. Right. He's coming yeah. to say hi. Um, to show you a new product, which is called a release paper dispenser. Yes. And if you don't know what release papers are, because we should probably start with that to begin with, um, release papers have a different coating on one side of them so if you don't worry I'm not gonna stick these the wrong way and then I'll like not be able to take them off <laughs> so what you can do is you can stick them down and then there's bigger ones and smaller ones and then basically if you wanted to work on a section you can peel it back and work on it instead of continuing to use the clear cover that comes on most diamond paints if you have poured glue I'm pretty positive 100% of the time, well, we'll just say 99.99% .99 of the time, it's going to come with clear plastic. I like using cover minders to hold them back, but some people like to use release papers because then it allows you to work on just one section at a time. Or as I like to say, portioning. Portioning. Oh, there you go. Because sometimes they can be really daunting to have a big canvas, and so it helps you like cover it up, and then yeah. you can just work by sections, and then you're like, oh, I made a whole lot of progress. So, what have you, you designed? Grab it from the other end. There you go. Yeah. What have you designed, Jamie? I have designed this thing. Mm -hmm. So this, as you said earlier, is the release paper dispenser. Mm -hmm. I wanted to call it the release paper releaser, but oh. apparently that was too goofy. <laughs> uh, so it's got this thing on the inside. You uh -huh. can sort of see the four on the four corners. There are magnets on the inside. Yep. And they're all facing the same direction. And they built are. into this. <laughs> this time. We hope so. <laughs> <laughs> and there's also four magnets printed into this. Yes. So I'll just demonstrate science. on the outside. Right, science. Uh, look, it's a magnet. It sticks to it. But <laughs> magnets have poles, uh -huh. as we all, some of us, know. <laughs> and so you can levitate things as long as you keep them from, like, falling off to the side. Yeah. And it'll, it'll repel. So... so that's what we're doing on the inside. We are repelling. Uh, well, in backwards. Not now. <laughs> so we are repelling. So now it's pushing up on the inside yep. instead of having a spring. So like, how many people have been in uh, those old diners that have the metal napkin dispensers uh -huh. that you pull and they're always too stuffed? So you just tear the napkins out. Yeah. Anyways, those have those have springs in them that are pushing the napkins out. This yeah. is the same concept, but uh, it's hard longer. to three D print a spring that doesn't just wear out in five seconds so mm -hmm. magnets never wear out well okay they mostly never wear out <laughs> so uh this is how we're doing this so in order to load this there's a couple ways you can put everything on top or you can just kind of loosely put it in there uh -huh. and then and these are made specifically for crafts with crashly yes, so that's a, what we forgot to this say this is a collaboration with crafts another with small crashly. business Cra Crafts, crafts with, with Crashly, Crashly in the Diamond Pain community. Yep. And so it's specific. What size are these papers? These are the 5.25 by 4. Yes, I believe so. I don't know. I, I don't you. exactly remember what size <laughs> these are. I don't. This is what size I designed this for. Yes. But as I'll demonstrate in a second, this will work sort of with these two. It's just eventually they'll start spreading out inside. Mm -hmm. So put them in there, the middle. Put them in there. All right, so now this is still sticking out a little bit, as you can see, mm -hmm. this little shelf that's on the inside, the magnet shelf. If you push it in all the way, that's when it's going to start lining up with those other magnets and repelling. And then it's got this little door that kind of clasps to the sides. So it's got, it's got these little clasps. Yep. And then every it holds all that stuff in, and then you can start pulling your release papers out. One back. Releasing. How long is this video one, gonna be two, if you pull them out one three, by one? <laughs> Seventy-five. If I take two seconds per. Oh goodness. That's... Okay, so <laughs> this is roughly seventy-five pieces. We've got twenty-five of the large ones, fifty of the small ones, and there's still a little bit of room. So yeah. it'll fit between seventy-five and hundred of Crafts with Crashly's release papers. And basically, as you if you pull a whole bunch out, then as you can see, it still went to the top. So it's still 
polarizing? Not polarizing. Oh, this is a very polarizing product. Okay, so it's polarizing. And if for some reason, if you push it back down and they don't move, then all you have to do is open the door and then it'll kind of release it again and then you can close the door back. But we wouldn't suggest doing that so much. And then, can and then, you travel with it? Yeah. How do you do that? So, so guess what, guys? We can also <laughs> take advantage of the... the polarizing effect of magnets mm -hmm. and instead of repelling we can put it in we can turn it around to where it's attracting to the bottom and then it just kind of clamps down on those release papers instead right so they don't and then well i mean if you so shake it but if, if you, you shake it, it yeah it's going to come out but it it should hold those down and hold them flat yeah and that's it. And that's it. So that's, that's our new product. That's a collaboration, again, that we're doing with Crafts to Crashly. So this is made specifically for the release papers that they offer. Um, so it's not like if you ask us, does it work for any other ones? We're going to say, I don't know. <laughs> Figure it out because it specifically works for these ones. We want to work together. So we have a link to their website on our website. Yes. For this, the listing, there we go, listing is the word I was to give. So we have it on the listing, and then on their listings for their release papers, you can find the release paper dispensers. So we're co, like, Mingling. working together things. Um, and so we sold out really fast the first time. We listed a few more, sold out again. So as of when this video gets posted, I have printed some extra ones. And so I, and everyone's like, when are you going to list them again? So surprise, if you're watching this video, then you'll know that there will be a few that are going to be listed on the website. Quick, go check it out. Yeah. Cause Jamie's about to change the printers. I'm going to work on uploading the video. And so simultaneously I'll know exactly what colors and everything we have left to list ipso facto yeah i don't know we're saying words oh, okay <laughs> but yeah so thanks for watching don't forget to hit that thumbs up button so that the other way okay. dang it yeah <laughs> thumbs up button uh subscribe hit the little bell button to be notified of future videos that we do and we would love to have you as subscribers we're working towards our 3000 goal and we'd love to have you so until next time we will see you then bye everyone bye Thank you.